How much have you been able to do this week? Uh, not a lot really. We had half an hour training session on Monday and then we're off Tuesday, Wednesday and obviously training indoors today so it's quite difficult because when you have a few days off it's hard to get going again so you know, this will be our second day this week training that's all. What's the surface like in here? Yeah it's alright, Look, it's better than the training ground so um, but that's better than that at the moment because it's covered in snow but yeah it's alright, it's a bit hard in the body low after a session but um, we should be alright, we look after ourselves after, after today and then um, get a nice bath when we get home and should be okay get, get to the eight depends like what, what's been the sort of the, the feeling about about last Saturday now you've sort of got through it if you like yeah um, like I mean I wasn't involved but everybody's look, everybody was quite looking forward to it like on um, the, we made the weekend of it like we travelled on the Friday and we were all looking forward to it so uh, obviously disappointed to get beaten but we move on now and like the gaffer said I think um, the league's the priority isn't it and they're not a bad team let's be fair so something, yeah, good team, yeah, very good team, yeah. Like I think that was the second string as well. I don't think that was the fourth team, but um, yeah, they're a good team, and you know we gave. I mean, it's unfortunate because I think we could have gave them a bit more of a game if we went so sloppy in the first half. But I was just sitting there watching, so it's easier said than done watching it on the sideline. So, but yeah, I thought we gave a good, reasonable account of ourselves, and then um, like I said, move on now. And the league's more important, I think. You're looking at the table just outside the playoffs. Virtually everybody fit, no injuries. I mean, it's a decent first third of the season for you. Yeah, touch wood. Like, um, yeah, it is. We've done, done really well, I think. I mean, considering where the team was last year, this is. I think this is a completely different team, is it? I don't know, but um, yeah, it's a good start for us, and hopefully we can. Um, have a good Christmas now, get a good Christmas under their belts and that'll set us up nicely. Noticeably at Hereford you were coming in off the wing looking yeah. looking for work. Is that what Mark wants you to do or was that you just getting frustrated you weren't getting the yeah, ball? Yeah, I mean like I'm one of those players, if, it's not, if I'm not getting out on the, on the wing, like I'll try and get involved at some stage or you just try and do something, you know, because otherwise you get out of the game and you're not involved at all. But I think they're, they're, re- they're, they're all right with it, but they would have rather me stay out a bit more in the wing, but um, that was a long time ago now it seems like, so we move on. It's that old thing, isn't it? Of, was it getting chalk on your boots? Is what they yeah. say to try and give the side some width. Yeah, I know what they're saying, like. But I mean, at the end of the day, like, if I wasn't, if I'm, like I said, if I'm not getting it, if you're out of the game, like, you're, you know, and I didn't feel I was getting the ball in the game, so I just tried to win and do something a little bit different. You know what I mean? Causing a problem, but um, maybe I did come over a bit too much, like in that game. But uh, like I said, now it's gone. Now it feels like age you got that. It's, um, what nearly three weeks ago? Yeah. I mean, have you spoken much about Lincoln? <laughs> no, like uh, I think. I mean, we haven't had a chance because we haven't been. We only train Monday for half an hour, and then like we've been off Tuesday, Wednesday, and then it's tours now, and just come into the train. So we haven't spoke at about Lincoln at all. But he might he might say something today about him. I don't know. But um, like I said, no, not yet. But I don't even know if the game's on or what's happening. So we're we're, like I said, we're all in limbo at the moment. No one knows what's going on with the, with that. The, the only thing about, about the season I mean, is that you are a game behind because of the abandonment mm. against South End. You might be two games behind after this weekend, and, yeah. it, and it skews the table a bit. Yeah, don't mind about South Angie. <laughs> It's a bit of a nightmare, but um, yeah, like it doesn't matter. Like, at the end of the day, like we have games in hand, we just got to win them. Do you know what I mean? That's simple as that. Like we're going, we're going to go out and try and win every game, and if we win them, then we'll we'll be up there thereabouts. And given goals are not always a prevalent factor for you. Frustrating to get that one chalked off. Yeah, I mean, like stop. It was a nightmare. Like I think if I had got that, I probably would score against Morkham. And like I mean, I had a couple of chances against them, and so yeah, it was a bit annoying. Now I'm still on zero, but um, it's the way it goes, isn't it? Do you think? So you, you played in <coughs> played in teams that have been successful in this league before, mm. including Cheltenham, you know, four years ago getting promotion. Do you, it's right, it's yeah. still early, still fairly in the season, but do you think this first half of the season is a good sort of indicator that you can push for promotion? Yeah, of course. Like I mean, I think we're a very good team. Like to be honest with Chile, but I mean, obviously I'm biased. I would say that, but uh, pass it around. Like, well, we score. It's not as if we can't score goals. I mean, even when the top goal scorer wasn't in the team, I think we're still scoring goals. So. And, you know, I don't think we're a one-man team like what people say but I think we're a good team Yeah, we've got a great chance Yeah, and there, there is great competition all over the place mm. you've, you've had to be patient at times this season you're just yeah. desperate for a chance now yeah to... I mean like I played and then I think the first game back was Accrington then Reading Lewis and then played against Hereford yeah, that was my last start and obviously disappointing to come off but I did and we got a, like I said like, it's more important to get a result than but me, do you know what I mean? Individuals are individuals, yeah. so yeah, we, that was my last day. I thought, don't want to get back in, but see what happens, like, you know. What's it like when you've got a game on Saturday and you nobody really knows what's going to be on? Is it difficult to prepare? Yeah, it is awkward, rate? yeah. I mean, like, you just got to prepare as if there's always there's this game on Saturday, like, you know, and look after yourself, right? And then, you know, if there's not a game, then you look look for the next one, maybe on Tuesday or whatever. So, yeah, it, it is difficult, but, well, just positive at the moment, hope, hoping the game be on, but see what happens.